Hi guys, today I want to show you how I made these flower. And they're pretty. They made from cloud cheese fabric. You know what it look like like collection flower? <laughs> yep, I got inspired by like collection flower. I'm not sure what like collection you'd what tie up fabric but what can I get close at I can get only um, cloud uh, cloud cheese fabric okay let's start it um see my cloud cheese I actually fall in it actually they already you know fall in half and then I fall in half again so kind of like a four layer in there and you can use um, Mod Podge or the fabric stiffener um, let's see what a different the, um, this one it only topped it I use Mod Podge the rest I use um, stiffener if too steep, you can add more water. This is what I did, add more water. And this one, only two layers. I'm not, I, you, I think it too thin, don't you think? Did, uh, this one, three layer. Really good, I like it. This one, four layer. I think a little bit too thick. I don't know. Anyway. Um when you uh, apply a uh, mod podge or fabric stiffener you want to use your your brush tap 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 don't go this side or this side you don't want to disturb the the fabric okay i'm not gonna show you how i did i just it's too much time okay i already cut in flour did um uh, dye that I use uh, Tim Ho. Let me. I sorry, I didn't prepare. I used um, this one. I think you can see it. I think everybody have this. Did dye Tim Ho dye flower? I cut three of those. You can um, green mermaid. You can make with your color. Um, this one I make my inker and with the water I just spray them and this one I distract it um, in this one I'm gonna spun with the this spun dropper let me grab it okay gonna use my bucket here and put in here and I use this ink purple one here and I'm gonna dab I don't want to take too much time uh, use a uh, cream mummies or the ink color too wet and I do this one it faster Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you, this one I use Mod Podge. I don't know, you guys, uh, give it a try. Which way you like Mod Podge or Fabric Stiffener. And now I'm gonna cut between the petal. A little bit, not too much. And then I'm gonna use my teaser to twist the petal. And I'm gonna use my puppy paint around the edges.
and you're gonna let it dry I'm not sure how long maybe uh, 20 minutes and I'll be right back now we're gonna heat all the edges of the paint so the paint can pop it up I'm gonna put together okay, my hot glue gun. And I'm gonna use my limestone here. I'm gonna use this one. No. This one. And I'm gonna color it. All of this, my uh, limestone that I use here, I color them myself. I use this marker. This really cheap I bought at a Michael's. Use um, coupons. 50% off of 40, I forgot. Anyway, but I can I get. <coughs> I can I hear this one for it. On the center. And how I make this one around I use my Okay, needle and needle and thread here. You're gonna make a little loop. If I can make one here. Anyway, and I do this. And sew it back and you wanna put your uh, needle through the loop that you make and go up again and now I'm gonna use this I'm not sure what you call it guys I've I've caught the packet I threw it away With this one I put in my lid here you want to use um, 22 pieces of these. I'm not sure what side the gemstone here. Um, let me. Uh, about half inches. You need to use this one, 22 pieces. Okay, 22. And what I'm going to do is, I'm gonna put my needle, but uh, through one of the bread here, and put my needle down there. Okay. And I'm gonna make sure this one is close together, tie together and I gonna tie on the back okay and then I gonna put in on on this this side of the, the bread here and what you wanna do is across the bread the same spot and pull it back you gonna do like this around your bread to make to make this uh, stay still around the limestone this one it really hard to do with the uh, mod podge because 
too tough, not like the fabric stiffener. You can adjust it and when you're done you know tie on the back you wanna leave it like this or you want to cut some the circle paper to cover on the back that up to you That is very pretty. Here yeah, that's how I make my flower. See? Very pretty. I like it. And I hope you guys do too. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.